What's going on YouTube? This is Jim G7. We got another one of a prank review. And I actually made my decision on this uh, purchase that I did, this item that I bought. Now, I, you know, if you guys have been watching my videos, I told you that before on one of my videos that I'm looking for a particular backpack and I don't know which one I want that will fit my needs to where it's very doable. So I went with Vertex, V-E-R-T-X. And the reason why I did with Vertex because their backpacks are somewhat modular, modular to where you can have um, <clears throat> Velcro to your magazines, uh, your uh, 1911s, your 9mm pistols and whatnot, and you're also your AR-15 pistols as well. So the um, so I went with the Vertex um, Commuter Sling 2.0. So as it uh, as it fits my needs, it's also kind of tight. Uh, uh, you guys see my other videos that I also made a uh, 300 blackout with a 10 inch barrel. <clears throat> so give and take for that particular rifle for this backpack, it was really snug. But I've got it to where it's made to work and it works. So right now I have a sling on me right now, okay? And this is what it looks like, okay? So this backpack here is a... Uh, Two point sling has one in here. Also, it has a um, another buckle right here that uh, you can add to this as well. That way, now you have a three point sling instead of just a two point sling. And usually, on normal traditional backpacks, you have one right here, one strap right here, and one strap right here. Well, this is all the way across. Okay, back here, this very very I'll have a lot of padding here as well. Also, just show the symbol of Vertex, okay? And here is the Vertex, um, okay, it's a little tag here. This is a commuter sling 2.0, if you guys can see it, okay? <clears throat> Shows you the, the liters, 17 liters, 19.5 in height by 11.75 inches. Uh, WX seven inches deep, so I guess that's deep. Laptops up to 15 inches. Uh, key features, fast weapon access, was never easier or more stylish. Rifle compatible, uh, concealed carry compatible, convert uh, front flap, um, stores behind the loop. Has a tactical mole, mole, uh, mole, uh, mole weapon. Uh, panel to provide really access to uh, items mounted there and rapidly charge the bag appearance. Snaps in place, make compartment, 3D molding, built for prepared professional. And that's pretty much about it. Powered by Velcro. So I got the back black color. Okay. So as you can see, there is a loop right here. You can pull this down. Also, right here. It's a pocket to hold your backpack like this, okay? If you don't want to hold it like this, do hold it like this. That's a feature for that, okay? Over here, underneath this, if you pull this tab, there's two zippers here on both sides. And also inside between, between in this socket here, is spread open here, okay? So it expands out, okay? So and when you when you pull it out, as, as in so, there are two buckles right here that, that is connected to a, a button. A button, all you do is rip that off. That way, if someone trying to rip this down, they can't rip it off. So you have to undo the buttons on both sides. And then, rips out. And this expands out, okay? Right here, all you do is adjust your Velcro and it expands out. You can put your, your motorcycle helmet, pair of shoes, uh, your football helmet, whatever the case may be, you can put it right here and it just snaps right on and holds in place. Molly webbing, Velcro right here, has Molly webbings right here as well. Okay, it's a nice little feature. And as I was saying, they have button buckles right here. 
on both sides. Okay? Close it back up. And when you put it back, you gotta make sure the buttons are back in place and they're inside. See the buttons right here, they're inside. You guys can see it. Okay, all I do is pop them in place. Do the same thing for the other side. So that way no one can just rip it off as you're wearing a backpack and so forth. <clears throat> Tuck it in. Put the zippers up. And that's it. Okay, now this side here is it opens halfway it doesn't open like a full open like a sandwich it opens halfway well actually let me get to the main main objective first before i get to that part now also over here has a handle for your backpack it has a padding right here in the back a little slot okay you can put like whatever you want like a, a notebook a uh um something flat you know, you can put it right here, it's not going anywhere, okay? Now, for the main, why, main reason why I got this is, is this feature that holds out. So if I were to wore this, there is a pull tab, the biggest pull tab right here. And this zipper here connects with that, okay? And why you see a big ass flat pull tab? And I'll show you the reason why. So let's say, I, you know, wearing this, I'm in the road or whatever, whatnot, and something ever happens. The first thing I'll do is I'll grab this tab right here. I'll pull toward me, rip like this, and bust up my AR. Okay? Now, down this backpack, Now this backpack, as you zip down here, oh, this lips, this this zipper here has a lock on it, so you can put like a little small lock on it if you want to. You connect that with a big tab zipper. You put them together and you can put a lock on it so no one have access to the firearm. When you pull all the way down, there's a bungee right here. Well, it's kind of a buckle, more of a bungee. Um, it holds. So it, what happens is that it keeps the backpack together. That way. And no one can see and expose your firearm, your, your AR pistol or your pistol, whatever the case may be. So you can undo it. There's a buckle right here. You undo it, pull apart, and it opens even wider like a like a sandwich. Okay? So there's a buckle here's a really nice feature here. Down here is your compartment. Okay, right here is soft. This is where your velcro sits into. Here is where your uh your AR sits onto. Okay. Also a really nice feature. Was it this one? Or this one? No, this one here. Okay, so over here, you it's velcro. So what you do is you un, you undo this and underneath, okay, underneath here, you put your um your uh your your soft body armor. So that way it's also bullet ballistic resistance as well. So instead of having a, wearing a plate carrier on yourself every day, you can have one that's big enough that will fit this backpack and it slides in here and it fits this whole entire part. Okay, it'll fit this whole entire part right here. And Premier uh, Soft Body Armor makes those as well. Um, I haven't got one yet. I've, I, haven't got, I haven't come across it. I was still deciding which type of and check it out and make sure everything works and everything fits me first before I get a, a soft body armor. And they're, like, they're not that expensive, they're like $149 just for the, uh, the soft body armor. And you know, now that I got it, now I like it, so I'm now trying to get one in the future. So also, as you can see, these are the accessories. Now, they have many different accessories, okay? So this accessories carries your mags. They make one to carry for your gun. They make one carry for um, universal size, so you can wrap your, you can wrap the, 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 um, the Velcros around that product, and then once you lock it up and, 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 and seat it properly, then you can put it anywhere that's Velcro, and I have it right here. So I have a spare mag here, obviously, okay, as you can see, I Velcroed it, okay, 
So it's easy to come off, easy to come on, on, off. Right here, this is another one like this, but the reason why I put like this, cause where my my folding stock, where my allow a lot of technical uh, folding stock, the zipper kind of nicks it. So I put this on top. So when I put my rifle in, I put the latch forward to cover that edge part where my, my rifle doesn't have. That way the zipper doesn't ding it. But as you can see, it deploys fast. It, it fits my my uh, my AR pistol in here perfectly. It's a tight fit, but perfectly. I need to get one more one of these and put one more right here more like side like this, it's for my suppressor. But that's later down the road when I get my suppressor out of the ATF gel. Anyhow, okay, that's what it looks like. And over here, when you do this, this only opens halfway, okay? It only opens halfway. Now right here, this is where the other Velcro accessory that you make it as your left hand or right hand this is where my 1911 goes if i don't want to carry it on my waist and want to put it in my backpack i can put it right here okay i already got it set in here you got a pocket right here this side here is soft it's good for velcro over here is slick uh it's not ready for velcro okay over here i got my cat cat t cat five here or cat seven which you prefer you got one, two, three, four, four slots here. You can put a pin here, whatever you want. Um, a needle, comp a compressing needle as well. Uh, Sharpies, uh, pencils, pen, highlighter markers, whatever the case may be. Okay. Also over here, this is where you put your laptop. It has a book over here, so you can put your laptop together. It holds it in place. Okay. And up here, it has a little tab. Okay, right here. I do not know exactly what this tab does, okay? Because, like I said, um, but it could be for hanging whatever you want to hang up here, okay? It does kind of expands out. As you can see, it's pretty deep and wide. This here does expands out to make it bigger, okay? And it's it's a it's a, actually a really good backpack, you know? I, I like it, and it fits my rifle the way it intended to be. So as you can see, I pull my backpack all the way around. As I pull around, I'll move my hand to the right to unzip the top part and I pull out my AR and then pull the stock and we're good to go. Okay? So like whatever that will fits your need. Okay? Whatever it fits your need. So this right here, I measured from the stock to the barrel was about 21 inches. Okay? And it fits in here and it's pretty tight. Okay, it's pretty tight. Okay. Just want you to be, be aware of it. Now, you want something a little bit bigger than this. This is the Commuter Sling 2.0. They do make a uh, Commuter Sling uh, Extra Large 2.0 as well. Okay. Just want to throw that out there, and then I want to put this bungee back. So this backpack, is it worth it? Yes, in my eyes, I see it's worth it. They have a good warranty. Um, Almost lifetime warranty. They have really good package warranty as well. When I got on the phone with them today, they said it's a two-year warranty when you first get your backpack. But their the backpack is really, uh, really rugged, you know, and they, they take a lot of uh, um, uh, beating, you know. And um, I said okay, so I I decided to want to give them a try and test out that product. And so far, I like it, you know. Um, I'll add the links to the bottom of the video. If you guys decide to get a Vertex backpack, okay, they have a lot of different backpacks, different sizes, different styles. I choose this style here, and they only have like maybe three, three or four in the sling sling style. The other other backpacks they had is that they have a very big uh, open on top. You you rip it out and you, you rip it back, and then you grab your AR and pull it out. Okay, this one here is more of a faster deployment. As far as you see. Oh, also another thing, if you don't want to hold your backpack like this or like this they have a handle right here as you can see i have a handle here so you can hold like this okay if you wanted to let me grab my air real quick okay so as you can see once i fold my ar is 21 inches Okay, if it fits this, you get the idea. 
Okay. It sticks right in. And you gotta play with, I have to play with it a little bit to get it where it sits properly the way I see it, okay? Now in my eyes, like I said, it is worth it. It is worth it. And for everyday carry. You know, this could be your truck gun. Um, that will fits you, okay? You find a backpack that will fits you. And I pick this backpack, okay? See, and there's a handle right here, see? So, the profile, not bad for a backpack. Okay, so I hope you guys like the review. If you guys want, like I said, if you want a backpack like this, I'll add the, add the links at the very bottom of the video uh, and hit the, uh, it'll connect you to the website address. You can check out all the other backpacks, all the different sizes. They have a messenger bag, they have a bigger bag than this, the garment, the, um, the commuter, and there's other uh, different accessories as well. So I'll add the links at the very bottom, just click on it, you'll see right over there. I'm not sponsored, I don't make any money on these videos. I do this, I see a really good product um, that has potential and is good. I want to share it with you guys. So if you guys are looking for one, something like this, here you go. Um, backpack is overall good. Um, it has a lot of cushion as well. It's not like one of those cheap, really thin backpacks. It has a lot of cushion, okay? Um, the backpacks, there's... These are somewhat uh, uh, somewhat expensive. I believe I paid this one. I forgot how much I paid for this one. It was over hundred dollars, like a hundred, hundred and four nine bucks, something like that. I forgot. But just click on the, just click on the link and it, and you can look it up and you see how much it is. It show you the the specs, the detail specs, the dimensions, the main compartment, the um, the second main is the secondary compartment. Other functions as well. They have different varieties of backpacks. They have one that you can put your side bottles here. You can put your medical supplies in here. Uh, there's some people that use this backpack for hiking as well, not just for concealed carry. They have another one, a little bit smaller than this, not 2.0, but they have a smaller one. I believe there's another sling like this. It's for to carry your pistols and three magazines, okay? And on the side of it, you can carry your GPS, your tablet, your, uh, your laptop in there with your other medical supplies like your um your your cat uh, seven uh, key, uh tq you can press in uh, you know a decompressing needle um whatever you want it just fits in there you know if you have a uh, dark angel medical gear or north or north uh, rescue they have a lot of different first aid kits you can put in that backpack just in case if if you ever need it or you go hiking or you're in a public and you're carrying this every single day for concealed carry EDC, yeah, why not? You know, um, I'm planning to put more in here, uh, my medical, medical medical supplies, you know, and things like that. More in here, like I said, it just came today. The guy that saw, I want to do a review for you guys, and and um, show you how it has good potential. So, I had talked to the lady for almost like forty five minutes just to be sure if this really fits me and fits my bill, and then see if it fits my rifle. The main majority that it fits the rifle. If it didn't fit the rifle, I have to return this and get a bigger one. But then again, you know, I don't want a backpack so big, you know. But this fits perfectly. It doesn't scream. You look at this backpack, it does not scream tactical. It does not scream, I have a rifle or I have a gun. This looks look like a normal backpack, okay. A normal backpack, you know, you, you walk around, you know, in the street, wherever the case may be, the mall, whatever. It looks like a normal backpack. Okay, what it is to see, it, is a, it does not scream gun. It does not scream, hey, I have a gun. Oh, hey, it has a lot of tactical. Oh, hey, it's, you know, that, that shows any detail. It's completely discreet, okay? So, hope you guys liked the video. Give me a thumbs like, comment, share. Um, tell me your thoughts. If you have any questions about this backpack, you can ask away as well. And also, uh, the link will connect you to the website and then you scroll at the very bottom, they have customer service as well. Um, the ladies in there are very polite. They, Vertex stands behind their product and they uh, um, they have no questions asked if you want to return. Easy, it's really easy process, okay? Um, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. That way, if I have any new products or any of my work event uh, working adventures, uh, I have videos posted up for you guys as well, okay? Um, also want to do a reminder, I do have a thousand subscribers giveaway. Once I hit a thousand subscribers, I do a giveaway as well. 
when I hit 2k subscribers, I'll do another giveaway as well. Just want to really heads up that's coming up pretty soon. Uh, just want to give you a reminder on that. And yeah, this is pretty much the weekend. Okay, so I hope you got, I hope your day is as good as mine. I'm not doing anything crazy, just doing anything special. And just, you know, doing more YouTube videos for you guys to see and for you guys to enjoy. And maybe this, maybe this backpack is for you if you're building an AR or you bought an AR pistol yourself. Okay, so that's all I have right now. Thank you for watching. Peace. I'm out. Until then, train quarantine.